Now, let me share this with you. There are three main things that recruiters and employers look out for in every candidate. Three things. First of all, you are looking for whether you qualify for the job or not, whether you have potential for the job. If it's an entry level position, you may not have worked or might, ha might have so much experience, but because an entry level position, they are looking for potential. So they are looking to see whether you have the potential to do the job in terms of the skills required, in terms of the abilities, in terms of expertise, in terms of knowledge. Okay, so you need to really um, understand this. So they are asking themselves, can this person do the job? Can this person do the job? And your CV must show that you have at least the potential to do the job. Then you will get called for an interview to prove yourself that indeed you have the potential to do the job or indeed you can do the job. The next thing they look out for is organizational fit. They want to know if this person, this candidate, can he or she fit into the culture of the organization? Now, every organization has a culture and the culture of the organization is usually the beliefs, the norms, the values, how they do their things, the kind of people they, they want to work with and all that. So if you research about them and realize that, for example, continuous learning is one of the beliefs of the organization. What you need to do is to ask yourself if you are somebody who likes learning. If you don't, means that you will not fit into the culture. And so you may not, even though you may be called for the, for the interview, you may not be hired, all right? If the value is integrity, if it's punctuality. So you, that is why you need to research about companies and know what they stand for and what they believe in. And the next thing they look out for is your passion for the job your interest for the job. They want to find out if you really, you are interested in the job or you just want to earn a living. You just want to find something to do. And whether you're interested in the job or not, it will show. Because sometimes when, when you call people for interview, they listen to you. And then once you are done with them, giving them all the information, they will call you again a day to the interview and ask you about the venue of the interview, about the time for the interview. If you do this, it tells me that you are not really interested in the job because if you're interested, you pay attention and you ask questions for clarification. If you are in doubt, you call to confirm. This means that you have interest in the job. And then the way you approach the process, do you call to follow up? Yesterday, I was conducting interviews for cashiers. And one of the candidates, I was even, driving before the interview the candidate called and said oh i am at the place where the company where the company is located i want to find out where the actual building is and i told him that we're not having the interview there but he said yes i'm away i just want to know how long it would take me from the place for my place to the location where the job is you know and it tells me that look this is somebody who is serious and is interested in the job so three things, whether you are qualified for the job, whether you have the skills, the abilities, the potential for the job. Two, whether you can fit into the culture of the organization. And three, whether you have passion or you are motivated enough for the job. So these are the three things that employers look out for, no matter the position, whether it's a middle level, senior level, entry level, we look out for all these things. So even if you come for interview, all the questions we are asking you, we are asking you to find answers to these very things that we are looking for. So if you are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified of my next video.